Today we are going to address the questions, are our Boohurt weapons real or fake? Just like this one right here. We're going to swing my blunted Bane Blade Axe at a ballistic dummy skull and see how close Boohurt fighters are to death every time they get hit in the face or even a vital body part. Oh. But before we do that, we're going to go through a few key sponsors of the channel. First off, 214, what a great brew. 214 is an Australian Army veteran coffee company that helps support veterans and its local community. I served alongside 214 on many field exercises and had the honour of serving them over in the Middle East. I start my day with a 214 almond blend every morning after my ice bath as I am ice bath wanker. And our second sponsor of today is Stay Deadly Armouries, my business selling beautiful axe heads, knives and shirts, whatever you want, stay deadly. Even fitness program, you want to get fit for the sport or get fit for this lifting your kids onto the Christmas tree, I've got a program for you. As I want to do this video as it would be striking with full armor on, I'm going to wear my full armor while striking this ballistic dummy. So let's, uh, let's chuck that on now. I've always wanted to do that. Anyway, let's uh, get into hitting some stuff. Looking back, uh, my shoulder wasn't connected pretty much the whole video, which is uh, annoying. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the skull here. Got this skull from Ballistic Dummy Lab. Uh, let's hope it's worth it. Uh, with an axe, so my two-headed axe. Also, I'm also going to test out a blunt sword, just on one of the cheeks, because uh, mo most of this test is for the axe. But just to see how dangerous a blunt sword really is from slashing, because we don't, we don't stab in this sport. So I'll probably do one of the cheeks with this sword, uh, but then the rest will just be how brutal is a blunt axe, or blunt instrument to a skull. So let's set it up. Let's get going. I said going. Let's get going. So two strikes with a blunted sword has cracked this skull all the way up to the eye bone. All right, let's uh, crack into the next one. Just shows you how close to fatal injury we are in Buha without armor. Not a big surprise that a bit of steel is gonna do some damage to a human skull. Um, and this is a blunt profite sword from Medieval Extreme. So if you do want any weapons from Medieval Extreme, uh, S-Ride coupon code gets you free express shipping around the world. Now we're gonna go into the two-handed ax. Um, we're going to be striking down on the dome, try hit it in the face as well um, and essentially we're just going to destroy this skull with this bad boy. Uh, once again this is my axe, the Bane Blade two handed axe and it is Boohurt legal, uh, 185 Australian uh, and obviously for Euro and USD it's uh, a little bit lower than that. So yeah, go into the link in my description and get yourself a two handed axe, it's a head only. Um, Australian spotted gum is the best half to do in Australia. And uh, yeah, just get yourself a good bit of hardwood for your shaft. Let's start smacking this skull. And let's see one more time, super slow-mo, first hit, boom. A little bit of skull out the back. Person probably not feeling too bright right now. Then the second chop, making sure they realize they're in a bit of strife. Boom. This is where you see all the blood like seep through all the cracks in the skull, which is crazy. Um, and then I think this is the part where the part of the brain's like, yeah, I'm getting out. I'm gonna jump out of this. But the sound effects, it may make it sound like a video game. It's insane. So here's the, the brain pop. And I swing all the way through. Top of the dome pops. Little brains out. 
Robert's your dad's brother. And here's the Bane Blaine looking sexy as covered in a little bit of claret. But yeah, hope you enjoyed. So uh, yes, blunt axes still very effective on non-armoured uh, people. This is why you need your armour to be in the best condition it can be in. I was going to do a back of the neck chop, uh, but as you can see from here, there's not much left of the neck. So maybe next time I'll get a full torso dummy uh, and I'll be able to test some armor and all that jazz with axes, sharp axes, sharp swords, maybe some guns, who knows. But hope you enjoyed the video. Remember, get yourself a nice Bane Blade axe, stay deadly armories. And remember, if you can't stay safe, stay deadly. Have a good day. Check out my other videos on how to haft your axe, how to build a pell, and any other boho techniques you want to be practicing at home. This is the channel for you. Thank you so much. Like and subscribe. What a great brew. And then I'll go into, and then I'll cut it. And then I'll like do, there'll be a cavalry. <laughs> about people shooting stuff.